Welcome to this, The Dave Show. My name is Dave, and today I'm here to talk about this accessory pack. It's a bundle. It's called a sports bundle for your action cameras, like your GoPros and your 360 cameras and all that kind of stuff. Uh, now, this one here is kind of designed for um, a motorcycle or a bicycle riding. You could, It's got a handlebar mount and helmet mounts, plus other accessories, but you can also use it for other things as well. Now, the company did send me this product for review, but they wanted me to show you all the bits and pieces of it and how it all gets put together. So let's take a closer look at this accessory bundle. Okay, here's everything you're gonna get in this bundle package. You are first gonna get this instruction manual that gives you an outline of all the bits and pieces um, of, of it, which I'm gonna show you here in detail. Um, but there are also some instructions for like the clamp mount, the handlebar mount here, um, and then a handlebar mount. You can do a, a tail mount off a motorcycle or a helmet mount type of thing and do the unicorn type of, uh, of connection on there and all these other bits and pieces. So let's take a look at the bits and pieces. Here's the handlebar mount kind of thing. So you've got um, a grip connection here. You just would unscrew that, pop it over and put this on. Now there's, there's two different connectors depending on how thick your handlebars are. You can see one's thicker. So a smaller handlebar like a like a bicycle maybe, and then a, a one that's a little thinner here, which means it's for a bigger diameter handlebar. So that would be um, maybe like a motorcycle or something like that. Um, you would just drop that in and put it into here. It's a nice little non-slip situation. They snap in, wrap that around your bar and close it up with this and screw it down nice and tight. And then you can see it's got a ball joint so you can move it about. And then also the second one has got a ball joint with the um, the thread for this for your screws for your camera. Now, if you loosen this up, you can you can change it in all the different directions that you need to. And then you, when you tighten this, that just grips that down, and, and these things do not go anywhere. Now the um, the this particular end, as I said, has got the thread on it. So if you have a camera that already has a tripod thread, like my Insta360 is a tripod thread. I just screw that right on there. If you have a GoPro that has the GoPro connector feet to it, they have little adapters like this one here that can go onto that and that gives you the GoPro adapter for that. Um, so that that's pretty cool. Lots of adapters. So there's there's this adapter. They also make this adapter that if you're doing a the GoPro thing like in here. Um, you can put that in there and now you have the thread same as this for your other type of camera or you can just use the GoPro type of thing on there. Now, if you do have a GoPro or any of these action cameras, you've probably seen a lot of these accessories before. These are pretty common. This is pretty common. It's the little buckle connector that goes onto here for a helmet mount. That's your helmet mount. You've got stickers for it um, and then your little screws to screw it on. And then you also get these um, these different I call them like unicorn mounts, extension mounts that you can use to extend out. Uh, and they do have little indicators here of which direction to, for the screwing. So when you put your mount on there, you put the screw through and it, it mounts on that direction and it shows there. And these are these are not plastic. These are like aluminum. It's anodized aluminum. Uh, so they're going to be very sturdy, but they're also um, very lightweight because of all the holes. I mean, that's the air go through, so it's not going to be air resistant. Um, so you can mount this on your handlebars and you can mount this upwards. You can mount this onto a, um, a helmet and have it sticking out the helmet like a unicorn or off the side of your bike, any of that kind of stuff. Uh, you, again, you probably know how to use all this stuff. And they have this little pack of these four things and they call them stabilizer rings. And from, from what I understand is you're supposed to take this and put this onto, it's like a sticker and it goes onto the outside of this to help stabilize. And that's what it kind of looks like here in the instructions stabilizer ring it's on some kind of um uh, when using the extension rod be sure to stick a stabilizing ring to the screw points uh, basically helps uh, keep it from moving around and that kind of thing so you get that along with it now you also do get a, a little wrench here this is a thing to tighten this up a little bit so you can just slide this in and, and give it a turn to tighten up the um the, the screws so you have a good tight snug fit so it's not moving again if you're on a motorcycle motocross that kind of stuff a lot of vibrations a lot of movement and they do also give you a little hand strap that you can mount onto something if you need to or want to and strap it on um, they, they give you that as well so lots of different 
pieces, lots of things you can mount. You can even mount a couple of these things together. So if I put this one here and let's throw a screw in. So now either I can make a, a longer extension or I can bend it. So now I can mount this onto, you know, something and have it um, bending around a little bit. And there's also another one here so I can mount this as well on, onto this part and move it again. So now you can see that you can make different angles, all kinds of different ways you can mount this stuff. It's, it's, it's pretty versatile. You pretty much, however you want to figure it out, you can do it. If you can figure it, you can do it with this. I do not own a bicycle to mount this on a bicycle. I do have a motorcycle that is currently not working. Otherwise I would mount this on here and take it for a test drive to show you. But the mounting part of it's very simple and easy and it goes on really good and tight. So these things always work very well. So I, again, I apologize. I can't really show you the um, it working on a motorcycle or something like that because it's it's not working um, currently right now. But you get the idea. You see uh, what is included and it's a very good kit. So there you have it. A quick little look at this sports action camera kit. Again, this can be used for your GoPros, your 360 cameras, any kind of little action camera you need to mount onto a handlebars or a helmet, um, any kind of thing like that, or your motorcycle or, or mount it. Wherever you want to mount it, you can pretty much mount it with this type of thing. If you're even a skier and you use a helmet, you can mount the mount on a helmet while you're skiing and have it hanging over your head looking at you or doing the unicorn thing with a 360 camera. Uh, lots of possibilities with this. If this is the type of thing that you're looking for, this one may be the right one for you.